it's Hoy's day, yay! We're all excited and we're all late. Catch up with you in the car, we're going in separate cars, because, oh, we'll tell you in a I'll minute, see guys. You see you there, drive safe, love you, bye! Hello and welcome to this week's video. I don't know why I keep asking me to hold it in the car because we've already learned that I'm not very stable in the car. It has got stabilisation, so when you when I edit it and it's jumping all over the place, I do think, good lord, she's got a very wobbly arm. <laughs> We're after hoy! Which for anyone that doesn't know the slang is horse of the year show. And it's your first time going to Hoy's, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I'm very excited. It is just the most magical, incredible show. You guys will see when we get there. There's amazing shopping like so many trade stands and they always have incredible deals Polly Jump are going to be there they've set up a little course oh, I'm excited to do so that so cute and I'm going to race each other but to win a full set of show jumps I think I or is win. it a set of cavalettis no yeah it might be the cavaletti yeah. wait no they've got no, two it's... competitions they've got a full set of show jumps and then they've got if it's you go and mini... take a picture with a stand you can it's win it's the mini jumps you can, ju yeah. you can win what you're jumping <sighs> that's what they told me wow <laughs> Okay, so this is how you travel in style at Hoy's. Everyone say hello to Abby. Hi guys. Oh, this is making me nervous. Oh my god. Oh wow, we're like full on behind the scenes oh, here, yeah. guys. Woo! We've made it. We've got tea, yeah. and you've got the the purple Hoy's glow over our faces. <laughs> um, so we're currently in the Champions Bar. And they're setting up shoe jumping just down there. So we're going to watch a little bit of this. And then Abby's gone to collect the other girls because um, they weren't ready in bar wrestling. And then we're going to go for a little tour, I think. Yeah. And we've got me. Exciting. Very exciting. So nice to be here after this time. Yeah. It's lovely. Oh, I do absolutely love it. This show jumping looks epic. Hey, pony. We are going to the international collecting ring. So check out behind the scenes. <gasps> Oh my god, the way. <gasps> Look at all these ponies. So we were just watching the pony newcomers and now Oh my god, this is insane. I'm not being funny about how small Also, could we play which pony do you want to take home? Can you imagine riding in a tent? I would quite like to take one home right I'd like now. to take one. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, I want the done. Oh, he looks keen B. Are we going to get to watch him in a minute? Oh, yeah. my goodness. Look at them. So we've got the working hunter in the top spec arena here, guys. <laughs> right, you know what makes vlog too, so no problem. <laughs> <friends. laughs> Introduce yourselves, go on. I'm Emily. And I'm Kira. <laughs> and you're having a good day, I can tell yeah. by the smiles. <laughs> <laughs> there we are. Good, good. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Right, Hobbs, do you know the course? Go on then. Oh no, they don't need lower him. I wrote the poly jump course. And Hobbs is going to jump the course. He's just learning it now. It's a little bit technical for a blesser. Last bit of a course learning yeah. there. They're talking tactics, Lise. What's your tactic? Um, I'm just going to run as fast as I can. Run as fast as I can, pick up my legs and use my uh, heels. Have your trainer. legs. Have you ever thought about getting your horse to do that? We're going to do the chop post time. We are going to time us. Oh, hello, camera. You're blurry. Hello. Um, yeah, we're going to time each other and see who is the winner of the poly jump challenge. Okay, we've got Han in the start box now. She's going for a hair tie. We call this a ponytail in the biz. It will make you go faster. Off she goes. She's wearing my Regina's. Oh, that was a big jump. And she goes around. She's fast. She's really fast. Oh, 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 you've missed the fence. You've missed the fence. No, you can't start again. Eliminated. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. That was. She missed the fence. She was off to a cracking start, but apparently the rules allow her to take two. And you'll see Hannah's not on a sports bra today, so she's having to uh, hold those bazookas up. 
Off she comes. Oh, and she's gone for it. Wow, look at that turn. Beautiful drawing poles. And over the last, she's got to get to the end there. What a fantastic round from Hannah Montana. Literally couldn't start this in time again. She oh is God, off. She's breathing. Now we often find that ponies are the fastest. Wow, she nearly had a pole there, but she has really sped around this course. Off to the finish, an excellent finish there from Emily oh. Dunstan. Lucy, how do you feel? Because your round was terrible compared to that. It was really bad. I mean, it was like watching an eight-year-old go round. Really bad. I couldn't even jump that. It's this is hard. this is a bit large. Look. Come on, come on, girl. I can't. <laughs> no, I can't. You've got one more attempt, and then it's three refusals. You're eliminated. Good lord, that was ugly. Next up, we've got Tina. Again, she forgot the sports bra. You're going to see those melons bouncing all over the shop. See, that one's hard. That one is big, but she's off. She's got the heels on today. But a nice turn there from Tina. Back to the large one. And it's taking its toll there, the, uh, the old the boots. the Whoa, oh, up she goes. And the last, wow, she nearly took the back row and into the wall. And she makes it through the finish line. And last to go, we have Megan Alford. Now, Megan Alford here is a five foot seven not Irish sports horse because she is not sporty. Actually, to be fair, not, not a bad effort from Miss Megan Alphick here. Lovely, lovely stride over the land. Oh! oh! I'm actually impressed. So I would say that the footwear was a definite advantage. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Girls, 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 girls. We all knew the poly jump course was coming up this week, okay? Meg, you won a hoist! I've been training for this my whole life, wow. I can't she believe leave it on the circle in, does she, Hannah? Today. I just didn't no, know what look at the went shoes. Through. I would have won that. Look at the shoes. Sorry, you asked to borrow my shoes. Yeah, and I would have won. Hannah, please. I'm really red now. So out of breath, we have come to the press centre because lovely Ellie. Ellie, get in there. I really love her boots. Won a competition. Was on any Instagram. Yeah. Won a competition to get tickets and to do a fun meet and greet with all of us. So we're here and we're going to do a nice little photo in front of the, the photo wall there. Right. Let's go. I have to give a quick, quick shout out. Oh, hang on. To HBS Equestrian for this lovely hoodie that they bought me. So I drove past their store in a vlog. And I think Hannah actually shouted them out like an absolute legend. But they are a tax shop, Shropshire, in Shropshire. So make sure you head over. But I've got this gorgeous hoodie to keep me cosy on the way home. All in. Hospitality drink. Have you seen Hobbit in a dress for the first time? <laughs> Guys, it's so loud. I don't know how much more vlogging I'll be able to do. Excited to go and watch the jumping and the dressage and drop horse Yay. Yay. I don't think I've ever felt so important in my whole entire life. Right, this is hospitality. Okay. Okay. And you guys. Look at the view we have. Day planned. 
So uh, we've got yeah. the most exciting day actually. I feel like you yeah. should do the talking because I'm literally so yeah. husky. <laughs> I'm actually quite worried. We stayed in a room together last night, and I'm like, you're going to get your call. I would like to point out I've done about a million COVID yeah, tests. Yeah, it's not COVID, don't worry. <laughs> we are currently on a backstage tour, the very beginnings of. Wow. We're literally going right ringside right now. Who wants to see the... Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm awfully sorry. I was going to say, who wants to see where the household cavalry sleep? But we can't see that now. We've been told off. <laughs> Quite a big tent, actually. Quite sizable. Huh. Not a bad place to stay. I wouldn't mind camping in there. Okay, we've come outside. This is where results go up. Oh, first class images. You get photos at some events from first class images. Yeah. That thing we're as good as the Hoyes competitors. Yeah. Okay, so we've walked through all the stabling. 800 stables. Apparently they come in three weeks before to put them all up because it takes forever. There you are, a little insight into a stable. But this is the exercise pen, and Charlotte was just telling us apparently this runs pretty much all night because obviously it's up to 800 horses, well more than that, coming and going throughout the whole sort of show. So they'll get a time, and they get to come and exercise their horses out here, the lovely Andrew Bowen surface. But they'll literally get the slots; they have to come out. So she's saying sometimes you'll get these big international show jumpers along with like the little Welsh ponies or the mounted games ponies. I think it's really fun. Literally, oh, everyone comes out. You can see we've got a show jumper over there and these gorgeous ponies. Yeah, how nuts. I was saying, all of the horses seem like super duper settled. You can't actually see any of these stables here. It's incredible because we've got Birmingham Airport. Can't actually gauge where it is. Somewhere <laughs> over there. There's so much going Geographical on. Geographical knowledge here. I'm sorry. Do you want me to, like, let me look for the the spinny thing. Birmingham Airport somewhere, planes going over, mm. lots going on, and the horses are just so chilled. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Oh, look at that lovely long hair you have. Did you just sm stop just, smelling your hair? You've got a really weird habit. What is she doing to you? So I had to sniff Hi. Oh, so cute. Come to the holding area part so you can see. There's actually screens here for the riders to watch, which is interesting. Imagine watching like people doing their jump off on that screen yeah. and how nervous you'd be. <laughs> and then the Puissance Wall. Okay, we've come up to the top spec arena and it is bustling up here. Let's see the warm up. Ooh. This is the warm up and then they go through there. Hoist, the arena of dreams that it says up there. And you can just about make out the crowds through that little gap. 
and they've got that arena that you'll have seen yesterday with all of the, uh, the rustic show jumps. I'm happy because I've got chocolate covered strawberries, literally my favourite thing when I come to these big events. Because mm. I've made you all hungry. Back to meet the household cab, and we're allowed to film this time. So we're walking by, but we're about to go to where the horses are kept. We're going to meet the drum horse, which is a massive Shire horse. He's so cute. We did get to meet him, and the trumpets you just heard. I believe they do at feed time at 12. Which has just gone 12. Yeah. That makes perfect sense. They do like a, a musical feed for the horses, which yeah. is just oh, look, adorable. They're, they're all munching now. It's so cute. It's just like wow. Oh, wow! <laughs> yeah, so stable name's Big Red, but his name is Perseus. Oh, he's gorgeous. His little white pad. How old, how old yeah, is he? I don't know. Five and a half. <gasps> so oh my gosh, yeah. and yeah. he's already okay with the drums. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah, he's doing really well, actually. He's uh, about, like, about two months ago, he, if we bang the drum on, he would just freak out. Oh, so he's just doing so well. He's been thrown in the deep. God, that is incredible. Wow, that is incredible. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, you're big. Earlier they said that they have to be 16-2, minimum 16-2 to come in unless the Queen gifts them. So apparently there's a little mare that's been gifted by the Queen and she's only 15-2 and she sticks out because she's so little. But you can't say no to a gift from the Queen, can you now? Hello? Hello? The, uh, the Greys are the musician's horses. Obviously the big shire, drum horse. So amazing. You have to like represent, okay, obviously yeah. when you went into battle, everything you had, like, the personal belongings were you and your horse. Yeah. So that would normally be like your bed roll, like rolled oh, up. Right. Like, oh, wow. And yeah, and then you'd like to take it off. So it's, everything that we wear and use is like, it's, it actually has a, has yeah. a purpose in yeah. it. Yeah. Or, or yeah, it did, it did have a purpose. Oh. So we call these jack boots. Um, so we basically pile them with wax and sink the wax in so it makes it uh, easier to polish and shine. Um, and they also, if you see, when you're on top of the horse, <laughs> oh my gosh, um, wow. it helps to protect right. your legs in yeah. battle from sore blows. This is the saddle undressed. Um, try undressed and avoid saddles. Yeah. Yeah. Naked saddle, saddle. Yeah. Strip, saddle. strip saddle. For like yeah. ceremony, oh. ceremonial yeah. stuff. Yeah. That is Very so cool. cool. And then it has the massive yeah. sheepskin. Yeah. Over the top. Okay, so we are back at the Polly Jump stand, ready for day two of meet and greet. We've just walked past the guys, thank you. Which is lovely to see. So yeah, time to get signing and saying hello to all of these lovely people. I'm very excited, so I will love you and leave you. So, just done the meet and greet, but I had to stop into Makara because you know I absolutely love this Ooh, stuff. I like this colour. Honestly. That was nice, Same. it's different. Have you seen the new jumpers they've got? Hang on. Oh, around here, right? Hello, friends! Hi. Hello, oh friends! Goodness. Sorry, I got distracted vlogging. These new jumpers are insane. Look at these ponies and beautiful drawings. Very well done. You're on the vlog now, give us a wave. <laughs> Fabulous oh, artist. So great. I love them. So during the meet and greet, we very kindly had little goodie bags made for all four of us. In well, I say all four of us, Mummy has one too actually. Individually done. So we're just about to unpack them, but my camera's literally about to die. Oh and that is so cute. Right. Just so sweet. Thank you very, very much. Right. <laughs> it's not the most aesthetically pleasing place to end this vlog, but my battery is flashing red. We've had the bestest time at Hoys. Oh, it's been so much fun. Going back to the cars now to say goodbye. I'm actually going off course walking. <laughs> I don't know. How fun for eventing on the weekend. <laughs> Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe if you did and be sure to head to Hoy's next year because it is incredible and magical and cannot recommend enough. I need a throat lozenge. Yes, you need a lozenge. A lozenge. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. Bye. Live, love, love you. Bye.